So right down here, my friends, is the legendary Frost Stallion that I want to capture today. Unfortunately, it's level 50, and it's super crazy strong. Oh my goodness, look how cool it is, though. And look how big it is as well. Now, the problem is, I don't really have very good pals to try to battle this. Oh, balls. Hey, you know what? I want you to attack aggressively. Yeah, he's got 14,000 damage, and that just barely did anything to it. Oh my word! And my Ingus just took a massive amount of hit. All right, you know what? This is going to be way difficult. That wasn't even a gun. Oh, boy. Uh, you know what? Hey, catch. Oh, no, 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 no. I promise I'm not here. Oh, this is bad already. Hey, go get him. Go get him, buddy. Oh, boy. Oh, yeah. Okay, okay. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Wow. And Ingus is dead, mostly. Oh, he, he is out. Not quite. He's almost... Oh, wow. I didn't realize I was going to get frozen. Um, this is so dangerous. Hey, where'd you go? Hey, there you are. Uh-oh, Ingus is down. Now, my problem is that my shiny Fox Sparks, which is one of my best pals, is also going to get taken out, I think. We're going to do the best I can here. Oh, my goodness. Whoa! Oh, I don't like that. I don't like that. Good, good hits. That's only doing one damage? My man! Shiny! Oh, my goodness, you just nuked Shiny! And I am doing next to no damage with my legendary gun as well. And Shiny's out. This is way more dangerous than I thought it was going to be. Oh my goodness. So I guess that means we get to come up with a different strategy. Now my thought is that these Jormantide Inguses are the strongest of the fire type pals. Now if I level one of these up, I could do something pretty good with it. I think. Now, I'll be honest, I, ooh, shiny box. I don't want to breed up the best possible one. I just want to be able to breed maybe one or two that are pretty good in defense. And this is the only place that I know they spawn. Maybe, maybe they're sleeping right now. Ah, there's one right over there. Perfect, so it's a dragon and fire type, which I probably should have had a water type, but whatever. Especially since like we both have fire breath. All right, that's not doing much damage. We might need to do this the old-fashioned way by dodging giant balls of fire. The old-fashioned way. The old American way. The pistol. Come on, stop it. And then we'll throw a legendary ball at him and, wow, barely hit his tail. Great. That one's a glutton and a botanical barrier. Terrible skills. So I captured a bunch of these things and I didn't really get any good skills. So I thought maybe we should try going over and capturing one of the good fire dinos in here. I just need to make sure that we're not taking fire damage. Actually, it's not too bad. Can I put on a defense? It oh, no. Taking damage then. All right, we need the heat resistant shirt. So in my very brief time exploring this biome, I realized there was a very dangerous thing. Oh, the dissected desert. Those aren't very dangerous, are they? No, but this one is. Yeah, the Suzuka. All right, we're gonna try it. Probably against my better judgment. I'm gonna bring out my King Paka because he's big and fluffy and the king of muscles. Hey, uh, Fluff, can you go take that big flying thing out? Actually, it's not that bad. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Use your shot. Ooh, that did good. I'm proud of you, big fluffy boy. Ah, stop on him. That works 42 damage. You, I'm kind of, actually, I'm disappointed in you. All right, just give him one more love tap. That'll be all we need. Okay, that, that maybe that one. You know what? Come back in here. We don't want to obliterate him. Now, I'm hoping there's a boss of one of these creatures, too. Ah, balls. Come on, get your ugly self captured. Oh, that'd be cool if this is a flying mount. I don't know if it is. Ooh, abnormal high skin and hydromaniac. Hard skin is a good stat, right? Ooh, yeah, a little bit of defense. That's pretty good. So I'll capture another Suzuka. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. I really hope I can find a boss one of these really soon, but this is giving me good XP anyway. Also, there's an egg over here. Looks like a common egg. Oh, it's a large. Neat. I probably have it already, though. Oh. <laughs> a shiny Toko Toko. That's hilarious. I love them. This might be a hard one to capture because they go suicide mode. Yeah, we can't let that happen. Oh. <laughs> Fell oh, stop electrocuting me. Get in my ball. Aw, how did you miss that? You dingus, get in the ball. Okay, those are actually pretty dangerous. Um, you know what? Ultra sphere time. And of course it misses. Come on, shiny Toko Toko, I need you in my pants. That came out wrong. I need to capture you. My goodness, they're more difficult than those uh, Jormantides I was dealing with. I know how to properly deal with them. 
you just tempt him to explode. Oh, I captured him. Oh, he's a runner and lucky. That's cool. Oh, that's the one I'm looking for, though. Level 45 boss. All right, big fluffy boy. Have some fun. My goodness, I can't do any damage. Oh, you missed. Oh, you hit it. Good. Well done. Proud of you. Good job. You, you missed your dingus. Come on, buddy. There. That'll work. I don't really want to waste all my bullets, but I will anyway. All right, catch this. Come on, buddy. Come on. Ah, let's hit you a few more times. Oh, you're so close to me. It's scary. Oh, come on. Get in here. No, 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 no. No fire. No fire, NATO. It's illegal. Causes environmental damage. You wouldn't want global warming from your fire NATOs, buddy. Ah, come on. Get in here. Can you imagine, like, real fire tornadoes? How dangerous those would be? How terrifying? Get Zooks, man. There it is. There it is. Yes. Ah, oh, just heated body. Come on. I was thinking I'd get some sort of cool skill from that. So the only other fire type boss I can think of is the Blazem Mutt. I don't even know what this thing is. I don't think I've ever been in this cave before. But it's a dangerous looking volcano. And I don't think my King Pack is going to like being in here. Oh my goodness. All right, King Pack. Uh, do your worst or something. <laughs> just, I probably, yeah, just step at his head. That's a good plan, you dingus. Oh, my. All right. That freeze attack doesn't work either. And his fire attack does. I can't hit the broadside of a blazing mud right now. Oh, he's on fire. All right. Let's see if I can do this. What are you doing, King Packet? You're supposed to be attacking. Because that guy looks awesome, too, by the way. Nice. That was a good trick. I like that. All right. You got a case of the dumbs. Have some McQueen Anubis in your life. The Guardian of the Desert is here. Oh, that's fire and stuff. Is she actually good at fighting? I don't really know. Um, I mean, not too bad, really. Well, I got a thing off. I didn't get enough hit points. Oh, but I did actually capture it. Oh, it's a Flame Emperor. Yeah. That's actually, I don't know what that does, but that sounds like a good thing. Oh, and I got 100,000 XP from getting that one. That's amazing. So that large electric egg we got, I just want to see what it is. Maybe a Ray Hound. That'd be kind of cool. I like Ray Hounds. Yeah, it's a Ray Hound. Sick. 15,000 more XP. Now, I do want to check out the things we actually tamed here. There's the Blaze of Mutt Flame Emperor. What does that do? 20% chance increase to fire attack damage. That's solid. I need to make the saddle for him, and then we could take him into battle, too. He's also a level 49, so his attack and defense are pretty good. You guys wanted me to build some other things, like the pickaxe and helmet as well. As the flame cauldron, I totally forgot about these things in the toolbox. I'm wondering if there's a better one than that. I don't think there is, but these things should help with that workload going even faster. Yeah, you guys build up all that. You're super good at it. Yeah, that'll increase that work speed. Great. And a pickaxe and helmet for you, dinguses. That way we make even more rocks. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that is significantly faster. Aw, oh, yeah. I like that. And then over here by the workbenches, we can put in that large toolbox. Kind of just hide it back in the corner here. But that'll increase our things here, too. So I need to make more legendary spheres. I need to make more le game. I need to make more legendary spheres. That's a little better. Not much, though. There's something satisfying about queuing up, like, I don't know, 400 of these. I can't count. 250. I can't count again. 209. And watching the Queen Anubis just absolutely rip through these like nobody's business. You guys said I can even uh, rank her up even higher by using that thing? No, this thing. And then enhancing my pal. I can put a whole bunch of points into work speed. But I don't really want to use these up. Just kidding. I do. Yeah, I would like to use a few. My goodness, this is expensive. Oh, man, we got the big souls, too. <laughs> Why not? Why? Oh, I can't. I need a bigger soul. But now we can craft up a few more of these and see how fast they go. All right, little friend. <laughs> Make those legendary spheres. Oh, that's so satisfying. And then Woo! the wandering merchant gets the credit for crafting all eight spheres. So I do have 31. Is that enough? Also, I have an egg. Where did that come from? My guess it'll be something dumb like those little dinosaurs. Or a flying bird. All right, let's get some friends in here. A blazing mutt. I know it's not the best thing. I do want to make your saddle. Also, you seem good. And then we'll take one more. Actually, the queen, you can stay back here. Let's select another fire type with a high level. I don't know if I have any more. Hmm. Reptiro could be cool. I also really want to unlock that saddle. If I can find it. Ooh, we can make a rocket launcher. All right, saddle. It's going to be dangerous. 
We're going for it, though. All right, I totally got to try this thing out. I'm so excited. I haven't had a new saddle in a while. All right, buddy. Oh my goodness, you're huge. Come here, I want to ride on you. Oh, okay, look at that. That's so cool looking. And fire mode. Oh, yes. All right, what does uh, Ingus Rage do? Oh, that makes the entire ground burst up in flames. That's cool. I think I hit something. And then uh, we have just the regular fire breath too. All right, all right. Let's see how this goes against our newfound nemesis. Look at this thing though. That's incredibly cool. Is that a shiny? I thought I heard a shiny. No, it's just the the cap wrist cap ready. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, I ready. I want to blow this entire thing up. Just drop a nuke right in here. Hello, friends. How are you today? And don't mind me. Just waiting for my skills to unlock and cool down. And then Ignis Rage. <laughs> blow them up. Oh, they have to be on the thing. All right, whatever. Let's try this then. Da, 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 da. Oh, that works so well. Oh, the amount of damage. Here, have a giant fireball in your life. How dare you shoot at me? Summon in the... <laughs> 10,000 damage. <laughs> Dead. I really like his running animation too. That's cool. Woohoo! Now, if this doesn't work, I do have what I'd like to call the nuclear option as well. But we have to see if this works first. Level 50 Frost Alien, 12,000 hit points. All right, here's the question. Do we just start it off with the, the nuclear explosive? I kind of think so. Drop the fireball on it. Oh, I'm just as big as it too. There we go. This'll work, this'll work. Ooh, ooh, that's a sizable amount of damage. All right, Ingus Breath. Oh, you, you can do that too? You do more damage to me. I have some rage on the ground. I need to move, I need to move. Ow, 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 I just about died. Run away, run away, run away. I got this, I'm gonna win. I'm gonna win so hard. We did 1200 damage to it. All right, buddy. It's running away. You have it exactly where you want it. Hey, this isn't a bad plan. We're doing the cheese maneuver here. Get it, get it, Blaze Mutt. No, 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 no. Oh, I'm doing three. Did you kill it? Did you kill my Blaze Mutt? Hey, have this. Oh, balls! Get him, buddy. No, I'm dodging, I'm ducking, I'm diving, I'm weaving. Nope, can't touch me. All right, it's your job, Dingus, to kill that one. Send in the fire flames. Hey, that worked. Why do you like me so much? No, I don't like this. The music is all epic and stuff. Why don't you do anything, buddy? Here, have a new pal to fight. This is just about killed it in one hit. But the fireball hit well. That was good. Shot in the face. If I do that at 11 damage per hit, my goodness, I'm gonna be here forever. Is that a stick? I just found a stick. Ow, 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 ow. Got out of there with him. Did you kill my other pal? My goodness, man. You can't have, you can't have KFC. All right, another Ingus here. Get off my liver. Oh, dang, that hurt. You just killed a third one. Nope. Okay, you've unlocked nuclear option. I hope it didn't come to this, but it did. Now, unfortunately, all my friends are dead. Hey, I thought you died. We'll just have my Anubises take them over to beds and make them sleep or something. And there's like a bajillion eggs. So nuclear option might be kind of interesting. What I'm gonna do is we have this base up here that we're not really using very much anymore. I'm gonna dismantle it. <laughs> this is gonna be so fun. Now it did give me the palladium fragment. We have the wood, we have the stone. And that means I can build a pal box right over here somewhere, hopefully, unless they patched it which they might have totally patched. But I still should be able to get this to work. All right, pal box management. And what I wanna do now is get every single one of my fire pals in here. Unless I hatch them from an egg, that wouldn't even make sense. But a blaze howl, yep, see that's an egg. We don't want that. That looks kind of deadly. Hopefully I can get it to fly over here. Hey, Frost Dingus, come here. <laughs> what are you gonna do about it, huh? <laughs> my friends are waiting. Oh, you're coming around this way. I don't mind if you do. I'll just give you a couple warning shots. Like, you really don't want to mess with me now, do you? <laughs> you coming down here? Come on over, the weather is fine. It's a little warm and toasty, but you'll make friends. I promise. There you go. Oh, balls. Oh, balls. No, I don't like this. Ow, it burns and tickles. Run, 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 run. 
Take it. Nope. Oh my goodness. <laughs> nope. I should have. I should have been flying. Okay. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. A little bit closer. Come on over here, Frost Alien. My friends have come to play. That's okay. I can respawn. This is a base after all. As long as you're still here, I'm still here. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> Come on in here. The circle's warm. You know what? We should get out of mount so I can dodge a little bit better. Hey, I'm here. Don't get stuck in that wall. Oh, yeah. Here it is. Here it is. It's crazy that it still killed me. There we go. <laughs> Where are you going? You coming in here? Why is nobody attacking? There we go. There we go. There's some attacks. <laughs> the fire army. This is great. This is the way every boss needs to be taken out. My goodness. Now, the one thing we have to be very careful for is to actually get it and not let all my pals kill it. Because we have to tame this thing. Oh, my word. <laughs> Look at all the fire. I feel like it's working. Oh, my goodness. Some of my guys are almost dead, it looks like. Everyone's engaging. It's down 3,000 hit points. It's right in the middle of my area. I don't even need to attack. This is so much easier than trying to fight it on my own. Oh, oh my goodness. It just did a ton of damage to a few of them. We have some down. What are you doing here, Wixen? And why have you stopped attacking? Oh, it's going after the Wixen now. All right, we good. No, don't come up in my base area. <laughs> That's amazing. I'll send out my own flare store. KFC can do some damage too. Nice. Wait, I want to rise on right on the blaze mud. Where are you? Actually, I can't because it's not in my party. I kind of hope it does not get pushed off the edge of the world, but I'll be fine if it does. Oh, great. <laughs> my my pistol is now damaged. That's not good. And a lot of my pals are too. Let's get off of here real quick. Put you away and see if we can grab any more. Oh my word, most of these guys are dead. All right, we're just gonna get high level things now. <laughs> so many different attack types coming your way. Some of them don't even matter. We're at a 2% capture rate. Should I try it? I kind of want to. I don't want it to get glitched out. I don't know if it's gonna get any higher than 2%, actually. I'll try it, I'll try it. I mean, I've got 29, yeah, we need more damage on it. Once this number gets below a thousand, I'm gonna start removing some of these pals. Uh oh. Okay, they're still fighting. They were under a thousand. Pals going away. I definitely don't want it to die. All right, it's out. We have 400 hit points left. Where is it? Down here. Hey, buddy. Okay. Oh, here we go. Here we go. This is it. Level 50. Ah, oh, shoot. I need to do more damage to it. Get in there. I need way more spheres in this if I'm gonna take out the jet dragon. Come on, come on, come on. I need this, I need this. No, don't hit me, that's mean. What did I ever do to you? Come on, 40, 40, 42, no. Music is so intense too, like good night. 42. Okay, we keep doing the 42. Yes! Yes! Frostallion! It's a legend! Ooh, and it's brave. Oh, I need to see this. Come here, buddy. I need you so bad. Oh. Oh, it's gonna be huge. Oh, this is great. Oh. Oh my goodness! I need to bring you home and make a saddle for you. Come with me, friend. Technology has gotta be towards the bottom here. Frostallion saddle? Is that expensive? Actually, not too bad. <laughs> Almost all my pals are dead, though. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> it's that mutually assured destruction. A legendary saddle. Nice. All right, Queen Anubis. Teach me your lessons. How fast can you build a legendary saddle? <laughs> I'm so excited right now. Thank you. I appreciate your friendship. All right, let's see this. There it is. Oh, yes. It's a flying mount. I didn't know it was a flying mount. I thought it was a running mount. Ha! Oh, this is so cool. I'm so excited right now. Look at me. <laughs> wow. I got to see its skills. And it's higher level than me? Yeah, it goes to level sync. So a legend. Whoa. Okay, 20, 20 and 15 ice emperor. Ice damage. 
Hydromaniac water types and brave attack. That's not actually that bad. Wow. That's so cool. I'm so excited. I didn't even know this was a flying mount. It's only skills are cooling too. This is kind of worthless, not gonna lie. But I tell you what, I'm gonna put you in our house here and I'll let you take a little bit of a rest and a nap and eat some snacks. Wow, I just straight up collapsed. <laughs> oh, is it cooling? What are you doing? I have no idea what they did. Anyway, my friends, if you have a name for our Frost Allen, you'll have to drop a comment down below in the video description. Oh, it's working for the kitchen. Weird. <laughs> yeah, drop a name for our Frostellian down below and uh, stay tuned. I think we're going after the Jet Dragon next. So thanks for watching. Keep your stick on the ice. We'll catch you next time. And I'd like to thank all my patrons and channel members, including Splatter Sax, Doug Rules, Skunk Chess, Brett, Dalton C, Scatter D, Mr. Cripple One, Baton Please, Fussy Badge, Missing Sniper, Link Hewitt, Tyler J, Nitro VR, Nitrox, Wyatt H, Otto Dave, Ben, Dicky J, Teddy Hippias, General Harris, Trent M, Kodino, Ritla Warrior, Keegan H, Zarnoff, Baxter, Ral, BC Engineer, Scars Marex, Spencer T, Whiskey, and YH. 